is this great? And next is Marvel's Warpath. And look how cool Warpath looks. Again, let's go higher. And this is from the Build-A-Figure set for Marvel Strong Guy. We've only said it a thousand times. X-Force right here. And it looks absolutely great. This package has seen better days. And here's everyone who's in the set. And number six is the right leg. And, you know, I mentioned at the top of the video, but his legs look a little bit short. Looks like he's been skipping leg day, and that foot is tiny. <laughs> but, nonetheless, let's take a look at this art. And this art looks great. Look at that. Veining out, punching. And he's got that kind of like a Joe Mad mouth. Something like that. Joe Maduria type of mouth. <laughs> Inspired, I would say. And I'm so glad. He has swappable hands, because what did we just say on the last video, uh, on the last uh, action figure? There we go. Oh, getting ahead of myself. Let's read what it says. Oh, he's like, why I oughta? <laughs> he's like, okay. Marvel's Warpath. A powerful mutant with superhuman strength and speed. Warpath is a formidable warrior with a proud and noble heart. And, yep. Let's get him open. Dun dun dun. There we go. Let's take a look. Let's see what we got here. So this looks awesome. And wow, look, I didn't even notice here, but uh, the X4 symbol. And this one and the previous sunspot didn't even look at it. So that's cool. All right. Let's get this little leg out. For a strong guy. Look at that. <laughs> and a little foot. Because look how this foot's smaller than this figure. And look how long it's like. Anyway, we'll set that aside and take a look at it. So I definitely like that he comes with two other hands and they're open and to hold stuff. But he doesn't come with anything to hold. So, hmm. I'm definitely digging that head sculpt. Look at that. No pupils for the eyes. Um, the hair is soft. I like the feathers that are coming here. Look at that. They got just the right amount of detail. So that looks cool. I'm like, how are these attached? They're attached. Uh, okay, so I guess we found out quickly. You just push them in here. So I guess you could take them off. That's cool. Um, I don't know if I would want them glued or not. But um, this is nice and soft, so is that. And we'd be able to, let me see, we'd be able to turn the arm all the way around. Oh, wow, we have the extra butterfly joint, so that looks great. Look at that. Awesome. Turns above the bicep. He's definitely veining out there. Look at that. Okay, we have double joints right here at the elbows. We don't quite, we go more than 90 degree angle, but um, not quite a 45. Okay, we can turn the wrist pretty well. And it's got great detail on this hand, look at that. So it's almost the same for this arm going on. With a symbol on his chest. His ab crunch is smooth and comes really far forward and goes really far back. Look at this um, belt he's got going on here. Turns at the waist, so that's cool. These legs are extra big and chunky. Like, definitely um, muscular, that's what I meant to say. And the joints are, are big and chunky, that's what I was getting at. And his legs only come in this much because they end up hitting right here. But it turns right here in the high part of the thigh. And the joints are a little bit looser than I actually would think for being this much looking solid built. Um, the ankles move really well. I like this is soft plastic and it's overlapping here on purpose. See, it's by design. It's supposed to look that way, like it's kind of blowing. And yeah, unfortunate that this joint is so loose, but otherwise, this figure looks really cool. So what kind of pose do we want? Let's see, what did it have on the box? Back here, he's just like, Mmm, I, I forgot he's got that Y-I-Ada. Y-I-Ada. So, 
So let's see. Let's see what I can get for him. And again, the fists limit you, but I'm like, you know what? I want him just flexing. And that'd be cool. And then we can extend the leg out so he can be kind of like throwing a big flexing pose for that. I think that'll actually work pretty well. Um, uh, the joints are a little bit looser than I would have liked, so it makes it a little more difficult to hold the pose, but um, still works well. Okay, cool. Let's take a 360 look. Okay, awesome. And let's see. Well, let's see if he's gonna stay because he's awfully wobbly. <laughs> Hopefully he doesn't remain wobbly. Look at that. And hopefully he stays in focus too. This is not a good combination. Okay, here we go. So I'm digging it. It does look good, you know? And I do like the pose, so. We will set him right on over here. It's a big guy. But you see his... You have to support his joints perhaps because they're loose. Wow, he's big because he's still taller than, than our friend over here. <laughs> Even though his legs are bent and extended out. Okay, and so let's move on to our last action figure.